Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of Let's Play. Um, I'd like to thank the FitMC Discord. I'm actually opening up the Discord to see it was Dolphy MC who helped me out um, on FitMC's server. So thanks so much for helping me fix this design. Turns out this hopper here on the right was just pointed in the wrong direction. So now both furnaces are in fact engaged. And where we left off in the last episode was, I kinda gotta figure out where all three of these blocks, the crafting table, stone cutter, and grindstone, I gotta figure out where these are gonna go now. Because this machine kinda takes up a little more room than I expected, so let's see. Idea. All right, so what if I take some smooth stone and I wall this room off like this. We can put the crafting table right here. We can put the stone cutter right here. I'll just put it right there for now, whatever. Yep, I'll just, I'll just put it over there to the left. That's okay. And then we can put a double chest like that. This wasn't really the goal of this episode. The goal of this episode is we need to actually build a fountain and that's why I'm smelting so much stone because we're gonna need a lot of smooth stone for this and I'm gonna use what is my favorite block in the game, a lot of diorite. Let's go upstairs and do a little inventory management and also get some. Wow, I'm not really going to have to do a whole lot to this area besides flatten it a little. All right, let's take out some of this dirt first off. We gotta flatten this out over here. All right, let's go. Let's try over here. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Okay, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Uh, that'll do. Eleven by nine will do. It won't be perfect. Nah, let's do nine by nine. There we go. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. There we go. This should line up. And it sure does. Next step, I need to dig out the floor. Let's go back in. And I need to make a cobblestone shovel. We are back in business with a shovel. Let's go. We gotta dig this whole thing out right here. I've got some water here. What I'm gonna do is, let's hop down in here and, where's there a spider? Where, I hear it. I can't see it, but I hear it. Okay, it's off to my left somewhere. Where the heck? Blindy problems. Let's find it. They're not hostile during the daytime. There it is. Let's get it. Yes. Let's go ahead and fill the bottom of this with smooth stone first. We're gonna do the whole thing, and then we're going to establish where the middle is, and we're gonna tower it up, I'd say, six blocks? You'll see what I'm gonna do. Let's go ahead and fill that in like this, there we go. So this will be water level right here. Let's... 
I want it to be too away from the walls. So like that. There we go. Oops. There we go. Nope, too much again. And then... There we go. So we got one, two on each side. Yep, perfect. How many wide and long is this? Is one, two, three wide? One, two, three. Oh, wow. That's actually perfect. Um, yeah, let's go up one, two, three, four. Ouch. And yes, we are gonna take, we're gonna take fall damage by landing four blocks. Are you serious? That's really dumb. Okay, I don't actually have to... Yeah, let's do it this way. We can do it from the... From the ground. Yeah, that's better. Mistakes were made. Okay, cool. Um, I'm probably going to... Let me think. I'm probably gonna need stairs. We can use the dirt here as kind of scaffolding because we can't get scaffolding right now. Where is our dirt? I thought I just put it in the hot bar. I guess not. So let's go ahead and block up all the way up here. And that did not land in the center like I wanted. Or did it? Okay, there we go. So th I think this is where the water sources are going to come from. What I want to do is I want to border this with upside down stairs just like that. So let's go out one and then we're going to need to make like a dirt scaffolding around like this. Cannot wait till we can go exploring for a jungle and this isn't even wide enough. I went ahead and rounded that off. Let's put stairs at the bottom as well. That's gonna uh, match the stone really nicely. Yes, I approve. That's gonna be nice. And that one's messed up, let's change it. There we go. We've got this whole thing lit. I have a whole bunch of dirt scaffolding around it right now. Let's go ahead and actually place a water source and see how it flows. Let's hop down. Uh, okay. Okay, I think we can do that. Let's go ahead and place the others. Oh yeah, I gotta go get more. Yeah, I'm pretty much going to have to go and get more water every time, but that is the joy of having an infinite water source in your house. We're gonna go back. We have to do this three t three more times. I know you guys want me to cut more out. I mean, stop cutting as much out, but I'm not sure you want to watch me do this again. So hold on. Let's get the polished diorite and go one, two, three up at each corner. Go good, that's not gonna give us fall damage either. There we go. Ah, this nice soft tinkling is gonna be good. Yep, we're gonna basically be using this as the center of the base. Okay, so where are our diorite stairs? And then we can, yes, that's super aesthetic. Hopefully I have enough stairs to go all the way around like this and enough room. One more, there we go. Now, we just have to finish lighting the thing. I did not plan this build out at all, as you can probably tell by the mistakes I'm making. But, um, yeah, here we go. I think that's sufficiently lit. I do eventually want to automate this and probably detail up around it a little bit. 
But you guys, I think I'm gonna call this a build. I really like this fountain. This is kind of gonna be like the center of the base. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed that build. Um, like, comment, subscribe, all that stuff if you enjoyed. And I will see you in the next episode.